Thieves steal winter fun from a local family. Its snowmobiling trips are now on hold. The trailer that held all of the equipment was taken from a lot in Davenport. It's a cold crime that was caught on camera in tonight's top story. Take a look at these surveillance photos. They show a red truck with that trailer hooked up to the back of it, taken from a lot at the corner of Kimberly Road and Division Street. Now, this all happened in the middle of the night at the end of October. Local 4's Ryan Risky reports the family lost thousands of dollars in equipment. Brady Pratt and his family look forward to taking snowmobile trips every winter. Once or twice a year, we do make it up to the UP of Michigan and go riding for about a week. Uh, sometimes we take them out to Colorado, Minnesota, Wisconsin, just anywhere that has more snow than Iowa. But their winter fun is now on hold. A couple of weeks ago, Pratt got some unpleasant news. I woke up to some text messages from my dad that said, hey, go ahead and post these on Facebook for me. The snowmobile trailer and snowmobiles and all of our gear was stolen. They kept their trailer at a lot on Kimberly and Division. It was parked next to two other trailers. Pratt's was stolen and the others were vandalized. They cut the locks on the trailer next to it to look inside to see if anything was in there. Cut the locks on the trailer next to it and cut the locks on ours and saw that there was things inside and that's when they went ahead and took it. So Inside his trailer were two snowmobiles, one of which had just been paid off, as well as some snowmobile gear. Pratt says it all adds up to about $15,000. He's frustrated, but hopeful he'll get his snowmobiles back. There's been so much being taken from individuals. I think that it's really shallow of people um, to go out and steal other people's stuff. In Davenport, Ryan Risky, Local 4 News. And this is not the first time we've reported this crime. This is the fourth stolen trailer Local 4 News reported since April. The first was taken out of neighbor's driveway in Rock Island. You can see the surveillance video shows criminals hooked up the trailer to their vehicle and took off in broad daylight. Police found the trailer a few days later and returned it to the owner. There's this incident from the end of September. The Rock Island DJ known as Candyman went to, his pickup, went to pick up his trailer at the Oak Grove storage in Milan only to find it gone. It had more than $100,000 worth of equipment inside it. Police still have not found that. The DJ tells Local 4 News he has a meeting scheduled with a Milan detective later this week. And it was just last weekend, Wilson Residential Construction dropped a trailer off with roofing materials. This was at a home in Davenport. Before they could begin work, though, someone stole that trailer with the $11,000 worth of material still inside of it. The owner of the company says the trailer still has not been recovered. 